I'm going to make a quick little video here of just one quick fix that sometimes comes up when you're weaving and you make that mistake. Sometimes you just cut it off. But sometimes you can save it. I'm going to try to save this one. I'm not guaranteeing I will, but I think I can save this one. What happened was partway through a weave, I pulled a thread and it broke. And it broke where it was supposed to be a long section of thread. So that space is open now. I went ahead and finished the weave by transferring a new thread in, but it didn't fix the area where it broke. So now I'm going to try to fix it. I'm going to try to fix it with a very specific technique. What I do is I take a piece of the same color uh, material and I wet it with color preserver, which makes it a little stiff. And then I'm going to cut it, hopefully to the size that I need, and then I'm going to wet it again with a little color preserver, and then I'm going to try to slip it into place. The color preserver is almost like a glue so it should stick in place. Then I can go back later on and put finish over the top of it. So, I'll squeeze in here and get close on this and we'll see if I can pull it off. Okay, I put the camera on a tripod so that I can show exactly where the problem is. The problem is on the right hand side of the star, right where my tool is gone, you see on this side there's two threads, on that side there's one. So what I had done is I had broken that thread. Now I'm going to take that piece that I told you about and I'm going to cut it, hopefully to fit that spot, and then put color preserver and slide it into place. Here's a piece of the blue thread and what I've done, is you can hardly tell, but you see how stiff this part looks now? That's the part that I put the color preserver on. So I'm going to try to snip one little piece of it to go into place always cut a little bit more than I need and then I'll try to go back and trim it. I'm going to shut the camera down for a second so I got room to work. When I come back I'll show you it with it in place. Okay, as you can see, I put that little thin piece in there. Um, when it dries, it's not dry yet, but when it dries, I will roll my burnishing tool over the top of it, flatten it out a little bit, and if I need to, I might trim just a little bit off the left hand edge. Um, I may not, just depends on what it looks like when it's all dried. Um, but that's pretty much how you can fill the slot and um, fix up the mistakes if you have to do that type of mistake when you're weaving. Most of the time I can um, repair a broken thread by either tying a knot on the two ends or inserting a whole new thread. But in this case, it broke where I was starting on the S to the right of it and it pulled out all that stuff that was on that end of the star. So that is one option, just one of many options for little tricks for fixing your mistakes. Let me know if this works for you. Thank you.